we worry about the client wanting us, do we really want this client? Whether you're a corporate sales professional or an entrepreneur, small business owner, or corporate leader, the big question we should always ask ourselves with every prospective client engagement is, do I want them as a client? It's easy to see green, especially if we are chasing that profit, that commission, that win. However, is it okay to see red? It's hard to throw up that stop sign as you're rounding third and heading for home. If it's your business, then it's pretty difficult to ask the hard questions. If it's someone else's business, then there are at least two of you that are going to be anxious about seeing red. You, commissioned sales professional, and your leader or owner have skin in the game too. So how do we decide? I've been in jams before when I knew this was not a good thing and frankly was overridden because my leader or leaders wanted the agreement. Hey, maybe it's a new logo or possibly the way they were paid or if public, the demands of Wall Street. I've even overridden myself as a business owner because I wanted clients. Checking with your values is part of the decision process. It's worth a moment to reconcile this client against what you want for your business and yourself personally. There's nothing worse than saying yes to a bad agreement just to make money. Relationships like this rarely are looked upon fondly, we talk about stress, anxiety, volatility, complexity of the marketplace, and their effects on us. Growth for growth's sake doesn't always mean good things for either party. How will this agreement suit me? So take stock in where this will go next after the ink is dry. What will life look like with this client three months from now, six months from now, a year, three years? It is possible to see around corners, look both ways before you blow through a stop sign. You may just hit a hippo.